Shalom, my good Israelite black brothers and sisters. How y'all doing today? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, before we start this video off, y'all know what time it is. We're going to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai. Yes, 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 yes. All right, y'all, so... It's been a lot of it's been a lot of dissing lately um, when it comes to the Hebrew Israelites, uh, the Most High God chosen people, and um, you know I get it. You know that that's what happens when when you're the chosen people. You know pe they come after you, and um, you know they want to tarnish our name. You know they don't want us to. Um, know who we are and um they don't want to accept who we are now there's this this fake wannabe pastor named gino jennings right that's all he do is just diss us right he be dissing us he diss us a lot because he know what we be saying is true now you have brothers that be out on the street corners which they're supposed to be doing you know we're supposed to be delivering these this word and uh, yeah, dude, just like it kind of crazy in the head. Um, you know, a lot of people like him. You know, a lot of people follow him. I don't, I don't get why. You know, you have brothers like me, and uh, you know, other Israelite brothers that teach the word, and like our following, you know, is uh, minimized, minimum. Um, you know, we don't do this for money or nothing like that, and fame and all this other stuff, even though that's what comes with it, right? Fame as popularity. Uh, but we don't do this for riches, you know? So I want people to know that, but um, nobody will overpower the uh, the word. It's just not going to happen. And this dude, um, yeah, he just always dissing us. He ain't the only one. It's a lot of them fake preachers. Um, T.D. Jakes, you next. Um, yeah, man saying all type of things about us that's not true even compared us to the Ku Klux Klan um you know he said something like they just the Ku Klux Klan with black clothing or, or something like that man some goofy crap and then he, he said something about us using vulgar language and like a foul mouth and all that so let's just get into the scriptures right let's just get into the scriptures so you said foul mouth and vulgar language, right? Which that's what we do. Like you can call it vulgar, whatever you want to call it. It's, you know, it's in the Bible. So we're going to go to second Peter two and 16, second Peter two and 16. Yeah. A lot of y'all Christians didn't know this, huh? Yeah. I bet y'all didn't know this. Uh, second Peter two and 16 but was rebuked for his iniquity, the dumb ass speaking with man's voice forbade the madness of the prophet, right? So you can clearly see that's what we, we call people that because whatever you do, that's what we're going to call you. However you act, that's what we're going to call you. If you're not acting like a dumb ass, right? Are you not acting like a fool? You know, why would we do that, right? That's a, you're offending people. I know offend not with your word. I already know all that. But when you act like that, that's how we gonna treat you. I mean, even when we were little, they tell they told us like, you know, if you act like a child, you get treated like a child. You act like a man, you get treated like a man. You know, you are what you eat and all that. You are, what you, like everything you do, you express yourself. Like that's, we're, we're calling you everything you are and what you're doing. So you can't be mad at us for doing that, right? Uh, let's go to Matthew 20, uh, 15 and 26. Let's see what Yahweh shall say, because y'all said y'all love Jesus and y'all all for him and y'all love him, right? And he wouldn't do that, right? Right? Okay, let's see. Uh, Matthew 15 and 26. We're going to see what what Yahweh Shah, which y'all ignorantly call him Jesus. All righty. This is talking about when the lady came 
to worship him, right? Because her daughter was sick. Fifth, Matthew 15 and 26. But he answered and said, it is not meat to take the children's bread and to cast it to dogs. In this day and age, dogs, you know, when it comes to a woman, we all know the terminology and the, you know, the B-I-T-C-H and, and things like that, right? So we know that that's not a good thing, right? Because he's only sent for us. Yeah, you, G Jesus said that. Yeah, the one y'all love so much, supposedly, we do. We honestly love Yahweh, right? Yahweh Shah. We honestly love him. Y'all just play and fake like y'all love him, but y'all don't care about him. But yeah, he said, it's not meat of me to uh, uh, take the, the children's bread and cast it to dogs. So how do y'all feel now? How do y'all feel now? And then the lady agreed. She agreed, right? Let's see what she said, because she agreed. In uh, Matthew 15, 27. And she said, truth, Lord, we are dogs. Yet the dogs eat of the crumbs which fall from their master's table. Ooh, don't, don't that hurt? Don't that hurt? That hurt, don't it? Gino, Jennings, come on, man. Stop playing with us. Y'all gonna make me mad, man. Stop playing. That hurts, don't it? Let's go to, um, let's go to Revelations, right? Let's go to Revelations 21 and 8. 21 and 8. Let's see. But the fearful and unbelieving, that's what we'd say. There's nothing wrong with that. And the abominable, abominable and murderers and whoremongers and sorcerers. We just call people by what they do and they're, that's who they are. We call them by their actions. You know how people say, call it how you see it? And idolaters and liars shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. Now we're not about to get off into the second death and first death and all that, but just know, we call it how we see it. Y'all can get mad all y'all want to. Whoremongers. So when we call a, a lady a whore, right? And then you say, well, what is she doing? Dressing a certain way, acting, talking a certain way, right? Everything about her spirit. Everything about her spirit, right, is not of the most high. It's not of the most high. Let's go to Deuteronomy 23. Let's go to Deuteronomy 23 and 17. 23 and 17. These Edomites always, when you're given a word, that it's like a thousand parking spots. Don't y'all hate that when it's a thousand parking spots? Okay. And let's see what he said. He said, there shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel, nor a sodomite of the sons of Israel. And right under, thou shalt not bring the higher, 23 and 18, thou shalt not bring the higher of a whore or the price of a dog into the house of the Lord thy God. For any vow, for even both these are abominations unto the Lord thy God. Whore. Whore. Right? Didn't he tell you, spare not? Right? Come on, man. That's our job. Our job is to do these things, man. And then y'all love to try to make it like that's not what we supposed to be doing. So 
if let's go to Romans 9 and 13, right? Just out the gate. I'm just going to shut them up with the word talking about offensive. Come on, man. Vulgar, right? Let's go to Revelations. I mean, Romans. So like your Romans 9 and 13. Now, y'all wouldn't think God would do that, right? The words of the most high or something like y'all don't think he would do that, right? Well, let's see. Let's see. Romans 9 and 13. Let's get it. As it is written, Jacob have I loved. Loved you, Jacob. But Esau have I hated. Jacob I loved. Jacob have I loved. Esau have I hated. 9 and 14. What shall we say then? Huh? Gino? Huh? Is there unrighteousness with God? God wrong for that? Most high God? Is he wrong for hating people? God forbid. God forbid. Come on, man. Stop playing with us. Stop playing with the Israelites. We only speak in truth. See, the thing is, y'all don't want to hear the truth, right? Y'all want to hear fairy tale lies. Right, y'all want to hear what goes with you, right? That whatever narrative that y'all trying to paint, that's what y'all want to hear. Y'all don't want to hear the actual truth. I'm giving off facts, I'm not adding to the Bible, and I'm not taking away. Right? Just look at the world we live in, it's not even a pretty world. But y'all want to sit there and lie in them temples. Stop the lying. Do everything for man to see. Your name is Gino. That is some Italian descendants. That's where that's that's where the that's for Italians. Like I'm a Hebrew Israelite Gino. That comes from Italian Greek. That's ancient Greek. And it means shallow, right? And materialistic. Your name tell on you. Your name says it all. You're not of the most high. I just gave you scriptures. Let's see you respond to that. I don't care what your little Muppets, your little puppets say. I don't care. Respond to that. We the Ku Klux Klan member. Last time I checked, we ain't take them into no captivity. The last time I checked. Last time I checked, we was on them boats. Them cargo slave ships. Deuteronomy 2868. Last time I checked. Y'all tell me if I'm lying. You just trying to come up like all the mother fake preachers and pastors, man. All of it is fake. Man don't wear no fringes. He don't keep the high holy days. He collect tithes and offerings, right? And probably do it on the Sabbath. You know? First they said, oh, y'all... Y'all, y'all just you know Old Testament, Old Testament people, right? Old Testament. Oh, we in the New Testament now. They running from the New Testament, trying to go back to the Old Testament. Y'all Christians got to get right, man. Y'all Christians got to get right because y'all confused. Everything y'all teach is Greek. It's mythical. It doesn't even make sense. It doesn't even make sense. It's easy to pick up the Bible 
and make some money off the Lord. Easy, ain't it? And you think I'm about to let that happen? No. Crash course, here we go. No, not on my watch. And then got the nerve to call his children out. Got the nerve to call his children out. Last time I checked, you're bald with no fringes. And you don't keep the Sabbath the correct way or nothing. You collect tithes and offerings 24-7. Somebody go up to him, he gonna take the money. From what I seen, from what I know Christians do, they don't follow the law. They teach against the law. They said the law was done away with, but yet still they collect tithes and offerings. They hypocrites. You know how the most high feel about hypocrites. Nobody buying that stuff, man. Trying to make it come up. I'm going to crash all of it. Everybody's getting hit up, period, period. Egyptians, Christians, atheists, scientists, archaeologists, whoever. I don't care if you work at the library. You got something to say about the Israelites, we're going to hit you up. Because, see, the brothers don't go hard like I do. Like, I go hard. They more teaching and giving y'all, you know, the lecture. I do that, too, but I'm more harsh with it. I'm more, I, I, I bring the world. I want everybody to see, you know, my brothers, they break the Bible down good, you know. They, 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 they have their debates and stuff like that. I'm not with all that, right? The only way I debate if you never, just don't ever talk again if you lose. But people, not they're not a man of their word. I don't trust anyone, right? It's going to have to be a lump sum for me to debate. I don't want, what. there's nothing to debate. There's nothing to debate. I'm stating all facts at the Bible. Y'all Christians are in trouble because the truth coming out. Now y'all trying to run to the Roman Greek language to prove points just because the Israelites did it. You know? And then now you got these fake preachers just saying anything. Lying on all type of women and men in the Bible. Not keeping it a thousand. They keeping it like 2%. I can't even give him that because one lie, it, one, one, one bad loaf leavened the whole bread. So it's uh, you know, they, they just the whole thing is just garbage, you know. But I had to send a shot at him because he keep dissing us. How you gonna diss us? We the Israelites, we the Hebrews. You look like a con. You look like you 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 sneaky and you steal and you 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 know you're manipulative. You look like that. What you talking about? We the Ku Klux Klan member. We liars and all this. Liars and all that. Like, come on, bro. Yeah, thought I was going to let that slide. Never. Never. We're going to keep banging on all y'all. Period. Don't care who you are. But if y'all like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Check my other channel out, Alpha Hebrew, where I do a lot of surgical teaching. Follow me on Instagram. And um, y'all just make sure y'all keeping the law, statutes, and commandments and not being like Geno Jennings. And make sure y'all being the most high, the highest. And we're going to bring this thing home, man. This is Alpha Hebrew. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.